Hello, greetings to you, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, and greetings in general to everybody, because here we are enough to do, so I don't know where you are, what time it is, so, um, in my last video, I talk about Christians, Christians remaining focused, and not losing their focus on, you know, on why they are running the race of their Christian life, you know, and I shared a revelation I was shown okay some of the things I saw in the previous week and uh, thus today I am going to be talking about the second thing I was shown should I call it vision or revelation whichever way you want to understand it or you want to call it is this the second one, the second dream, when I was in this particular dream of vision, I was sitting myself and um, some other persons, but there was a particular girl, and this girl, she's very young, and she's very younger to me. She's, I'll say, I'll say she's my younger one. And uh, so we're in this particular compound, and that happens to be one of the compound I used to stay back then in that state. And so as we are sitting, every one of us outside, then at some point, a um, an animal, an animal came up, just like uh, I think that animal is called i don't know it's i think the animal in english is called a bear a bear because it was having that face um those animals that kind of is not cheap as i don't know whether to say cheap as or uh because it's quite different from um from chipazi i don't know how really to describe it but i think i need to look for that i need to <laughs> be very sure of the name so this animal just came and uh at some point was making sign to this little girl was making sign to this young girl to come to him to come to come so while he was making the sign the guy the guy was looking at it and the girl was like i am not coming to you because i don't need anything from you and uh, I myself, I was looking at this particular animal, and uh, all of us, we were just seeing it. And it continued, it constantly was making uh, a sign to this girl to come to come to him. But the girl refused and renounced him that he has nothing to give to her, that he's not coming, that she's not coming to him. So at some point, I too, I was so happy the girl refused. Then I told the girl something. I remember telling the girl something. I said, look, I said, don't go. Don't go to that, that bear. I said, as you can see, because as you can see, as she, you see, he's not even real. He's fake. And what, the way he looks like, he's fake. He's putting on, on putting on that uh, cover because he's not real he's not for real so don't go to him i'm glad you refuse to go to him and to get anything from him you know so i was telling this little girl and the girl was like i am not going and get continued to talk to him like i am not coming leave me alone so why this girl continued to affirm that she was not going to meet up with this particular animal the animal got fed up get fed up and he walked up to her you know thinking maybe if he come closer to her she will fear, she will fall for him so he walked up to where this girl was a bit a little bit of uh, distant from me because we are all in the same place and uh, began to talk to this girl that this girl should come to her and that when this girl come that he will give this give to this girl all that this girl wants everything that this girl desire that he will give to this girl so the girl insisted that she doesn't need anything from him so at that point i told the guy i said i then i repeated again to the guy i said don't go i said because this thing you see is fake just look at him now i said look at him very well you will see that all he 
is having on is a mask. So as I told to this girl, the girl at a point was angry with this thing and she flinged her hand. The moment she flinged her hand, she kind of, um, it was as if she flinged the thing off the, 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 the animals, the animal. And all of a sudden, this animal, the thing fell off like a skate and the thing just, the, the, the true color of this person showed, it was a young, uh, a young white guy you know a young white man he's not a man and she should be of his um teen age teen age or most close to you know to adult adulthood okay just almost the same age 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 range with this particular girl so and um all of a sudden when he saw that the thing has felt off he just swing off and all of a sudden off he go and he began to fly in the sky while he was flying light off automatically swing all around him and every area and angles he went so he went to the other side of the uh, of the of the compound we were and that place became and the, there was light you know and all of a sudden he became more than one and it was like he was in group a group of his kind you know so they were just flying all around and there was this shiny stars shiny lights all around them like just what we see in some movies especially christmas movie you see the lights on place so white and beautiful and all that and he was just swinging all around and continued to talk and say all the nonsense that hey yes you see what i'm telling you that this is who i am when you come to me i will give you everything i will give you all that you want i will give you all that you ever desire you see you see now that the part i am is light and beautiful but the part you are is so dark and um there is nothing happening there so if you come to me this is what i will do for you and all of that stuff so the girl was looking myself we began to look at him and we are like you see we see so i then i was talking to the guy I said you see you see what I told you that he came he was fake and you see he's still demonstrating all those things that he's not a straightforward person he's not genuine you see how fake he could be you see the moment you fling that thing he turned into this right now this to tell you that he's so fake that this is all he has to offer then I continue to tell that guy then all of a sudden I woke up and I sat and I was like, God, what is this? And he said, this is it. This is the stage of the world today. The world, those that truly trust and believe in me, they don't seem to have what they want or what they desire. To them, they don't have anything. To them, they are poor. And they find it difficult to have to, to, to get what they want. He said, because the devil because it is like that for this moment because the devil and in their process of waiting some of them they easily give in to the satan the devil you say he said you saw the way that that the, the the guy came he said he was fake or true he said he's fake fine he has power to do some magic to do all that sort of things and to give to people what people actually need he said but it will only last for a moment that he has no power to give everything he said and he said that is what it is he said but every christian that is able to wait to endure whatever they feel it is suffering right now whatever they feel that it is pain to them right now and they can overcome they can constantly and continuously resist to you know fall to the other side of life of you know trying to do everything and anything by thing to make money to make wealth to become famous he said if they can resist and hold on to me he said finally i will show up and i will sham my own effort everlasting light upon them he said you see that guy he show all that he want he said that is exactly who satan the devil is he said because he has the power of darkness and he has the power of light which christ which god never took for him when he pushed him out of the car out of heaven he said so he has that power still with him because he's an agent he was once an agent angel of light so he still has those ability to transform himself into an angel's angel of light whereas he's an angel of darkness he said so 
this is what Christians need to know. That Christians, they need to know that they cannot get whatever joy, happiness, fulfillment they want from in the world. But they can have it when they remain with Christ. And that Christians should be patient and they should not fall for the hard times that it you know, seems to be uh, ravaging and overtaking the world today. You know, I don't know if I shared this particular one yesterday still in that revelation, uh, in that uh, yesterday video. He said, so they need to endure. They need to endure. Okay. And I said, wow, this is exactly what it is. That Christians, you need to be focused. And I'm repeating it, be focused. Endure whatever you think you are enduring now. Just endure it. Don't think... Uh, you 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 are alone it's yes it is true when you try to 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 hold on to god when you have when you try to uh hold on to god hold on to the positive side of life to the right step to the right side of life you know you don't want to be that bad girl that bad boy you don't want to follow the wrong way of life now to make money to make wealth to have it all it will look as if you are a fool. It will look as if you don't know your left from right. It will look as if you don't know what you you don't know what, with what your mates have gone ahead of you. But don't worry. Just keep holding on to God. Ask God for directions, and you to have a dream. Be focused. In due time, God will meet you at the point of your need. Above all, know that your calling is not for the is not to have the crown or a reward from this world or from this life, but an internal reward, a reward, a reward of an internal life, a reward of a crown that never fades and that will never be taken from you again. Because if I talk to you, let's say for instance about my own self, I'm I'm a witness to all these things. I have undergone a lot of a lot of suffering, a lot of pain, a lot I so I just needed to endure. But I know today I am not where I want to be. But and at, at the same time, I can tell you that I am no longer in that position of suffering, 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 and 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 I'll just look and I and I'll just look like a fool that don't know what what she's supposed to do, like just the um. I mean, what she's supposed to do to have it like her mates, you know, uh, somebody that is stupid, that, that that is stupid to the point that she refused to follow the the steps, you know, the wrong steps of her mates to make money. You understand? But thank God today, I am so grateful to God that God has has you know have liberated me god has taken me to another level god has blessed me and i know he will continue to bless me he has changed my story and my story will be changed for good in the name of jesus just if you don't believe me look at those who have really waited on god they are receiving their you know their breakthrough they are receiving their testimonies they are sharing it and they are the light of god is shining on them and they have refused to go away from the faith they just remain still standing you understand they just remain still standing and holding on to god no matter what so why am i doing this video if you are a true believer please don't give up just remain focused i know the stage we are now the time we are is so delicate it's a time that even what you see some men of god so supposed called men of god are doing now you will just like please i don't want to be a christian again but i want to tell you if you want to be a genuine christian stay away from church politics stay away from uh, just trying to be among the crowd in the church go to church and have your personal relationship with god that is why in the first video i said study more your bible pray more on your own Ask for the presence and the help of the Holy Spirit at every given point in time. Ask for the Holy Spirit to interpret the scripture to you. Ask the Holy Spirit to, to tell you, you know, to tell you the things you should do each and every point in time. And I bet you, when you start asking for the leading of the Holy Spirit, when you get to some places that you are not supposed to be, the Holy Spirit will just take you out of there. He will 
talk to you and you will feel it within you that you are in the wrong place and you will go out of there when you're about doing some things that will not glorify god he will give you a sign and all of a sudden you will know that this thing does not please god and you will walk away from there and while you are doing it it will look as if it will not end but one thing i will tell you tell yourself if this if if it means this is how i will end to make heaven let me end up like this i tell you that situation will fade away because it does it is not real they are all shadows and they will fade away just hold on to god don't give up have your personal relationship with god pray more if you see they are now saying okay this church you have to do this do, 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 and you go cross check your bible with it that it is not in line nor in accordance with the scripture just stay away from it just stay away from it and above all read more the book of matthew mark john luke those you know the especially the new testament the old testament too is filled with a lot of re revelation on how best you can live your life on how best you christ really wants us to live i tell you you will be so equipped that when the things are coming you will not be afraid when the things are happening your faith will become so strong like that of rock and you will not be easily broken and god will glorify you and in this act you will see the light of god enjoy the blessings of god in this life and you will still enjoy in the world to come i wish us heaven at last i wish myself heaven at last i wish my family every one of us i love you all my friends i wish all of us heaven at last and it we will not we will not you know we will not get that with our own strength but the strength of god will be so much for us the grace of god will be so our valuable for us to get there in the name of god the father son and of the holy ghost in jesus name amen i love you and until i come your way again next time i remember still of ray obehino obehi and uh, if you're new to my youtube channel please subscribe and if you like my videos give a thumb up you can share your view and we can talk about it and we will still continue to talk here i love you so much and have a wonderful beautiful day i love you and happy valentine in advance bye bye for now love you